Delaware Valley's leading news program. A South Jersey family is using a toy drive to honor a loved one who is living proof that every day is special. That's right. It's a chance to make the holidays brighter for some local children in need. And once again, it has proven to be a big success. Action News reporter Annie McCormick has that story tonight. Thousands of donated toys filled Sam Levin's family home and garage in Marlton, New Jersey. Sam's uncle and aunt created Holton's Heroes in honor of his cousin, Holton Weingrod, who suffered a traumatic brain injury at just 11 weeks old. All the schools, churches, and councils, fam neighborhoods, and it's great because we're getting so many toys. And once all these toys are loaded up on this truck, it's then headed to the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. This was the moment of inspiration when Santa came to visit Holton at UCLA Medical Center. We were sitting in the room. My nephew was in a coma at that point at 11 weeks old. And Santa Claus in a little wagon with firemen came by and gave my niece and my nephew gifts. And it was just this moment of like, somebody cares, somebody's thinking of us. Holton is Lauren Levin's nephew. On the East Coast, she spearheads a nonprofit inspired by him. The two-year-old lives with his parents in Los Angeles and is now mentally and physically disabled. His family loves his radiant smile and thick head of hair. Today, Holton's Heroes Helpers wore t-shirts sold to raise money for the nonprofit. Their mascot is an elephant with his trunk up and yes, that head of hair. The toy drive is just one part of the organization's good work. It's become a resource for families of children with traumatic brain injuries. The toy drive is as much for the kids at CHOP as it is for their families. The thought of even going out and getting a toy for for a holiday is not even on their mind. So to be able to go downstairs to shop and shop for free for their children and um, that are in the hospital is just an amazing, amazing gift to the parent. In Marlton, New Jersey, Annie McCormick, Channel 6 Action News.